Hi viewers, welcome to Smart Code. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to develop progressive clock program. I am using three different progress bars. One for hours, one for minutes and one for seconds. Open a new Windows form application, and start development. Set some form properties, like form's title and size. Drop label control on the form. Set some properties. This label would be the program's heading. Drop more labels and continue with the design. Now we need three progress bars, for representing hours, minutes and seconds. For each progress bar, set step property to 1. Set maximum property for hours to 23. Change controls name to progress hours. Set maximum for minutes to 59. Change controls name to progress minutes. Maximum for seconds is also 59. Change controls name to progress seconds. Now we need three more labels to show numeric values of hours, minutes and seconds. Set properties.
drop two buttons on the form, one for starting the clock, and another for closing the application. Set Properties We finally need a timer control, in order to make our clock run all the time. Set timer interval to 1000 milliseconds, which is equal to 1 second. Change the name of timer control as well. Now register click event to the start button. Start button will start the clock timer. Now we need to register timer tick event. Start with retrieving the current system time using date time class. Now call hour, minute and second property in order to retrieve hours, minutes and seconds from date time object. Assign hours, minutes and seconds to respective progress bars. And finally, assign the same values to the labels we have on the form, to display time in numbers. Let's run the program and check it out. Our progressive clock is working fine. Let's now program the close button. Attach the click event to the button. Our progressive clock application is now fully programmed and functional.